Oh my god, are you new here? We're just doing some makeup touches before the bus gets here. Oh my gosh, first day of school. I'm so excited. <laughs> Have you guys heard of Elf Cosmetics? Oh my god. You what? haven't? Good thing we're the elfing experts. My name is Summer and I love their putty everything, especially their putty blush. It's so fun and easy to use. I just got it from their back to school kit on their website. Wow. Oh my gosh. I got the Big Mood Elf Mascara from Target and I have been obsessed. My lashes have never been bigger. I will be strutting down these halls. Bring us our lash queen. <laughs> yes, she is. I am. I'm Autumn. Uh, I'm not a lash queen, but... <laughs> The e.l.f. lip lacquer, especially the one in Fantasy, I love it. I think it's like so natural. I don't know. Winner, what do you think? Oh, Autumn, it's beautiful on you. I love it. And I love makeup just as much as the next girl, but I need a good skincare routine. So mm. their Holy Hydration collection is my everything. They have a face cream with SPF 30, perfect for the summertime, and a cleansing balm Period. that gets all that gunk off so you're ready for the next day of school. Oh my gosh, the bus oh, is bus. Come, Come on. on. Come on. Oh, excuse me, what primer are you wearing? Oh, it's the e.l.f. Pose Putty Primer. Excuse me, what is on your lashes? Oh, it's the e.l.f. Big Mood Mascara. Hey, can I ask you what foundation you're wearing? Sure, it's the Camo CC Cream. Not me. Hi guys, I'm Anna. I'm the global artist here at Elf Cosmetics and today we're gonna show you a really pretty um, soft neutral look on the lid with a little pop of color. We came out with this. It's our putty eye primer. It comes in six different shades and at five dollars it really is a steal. I'm gonna use this as a base for her eyeshadow and what you would use is our flat eyeshadow brush and take a little bit and you're gonna lay it over her lid just to even out the skin tone. So the color I am using today is called Cream and I'm just gonna lay down a light layer to her lid. And you know how sometimes we just want a little taste of something? Well guess what, this is why we came out with these bite-sized eyeshadows. It comes in eight different shades and at $3, these are definitely a steal. The color I'm using today is called Cream and Sugar and I'm gonna be using this coppery um, rose gold color on her lid. And it's very simple. You're just going to swipe across her whole entire lid. It's very foolproof. You can take a clean brush and buff out the edges just to give you a really pretty soft blend. I'm gonna give her a little pop of color using this one. This is called Acai Yu. Acai Yu. <laughs> We're gonna take the first color from this uh, little bite-sized palette. And I'm taking our small angled brush and I'm gonna use it as an eyeliner for her bottom lash lines. Right underneath her lashes, I'm just going to tap it. So now let's go into finishing her look with some mascara. My little trick, again, is to bend the wand just so I can get in her eye space. So what you wanna do is you wanna tease your lashes from the root to the tip so it can give you that really full plumped up voluminous lash look. So there you have it. This completes our work hard look with some products that are gonna really work hard for you so you can play harder throughout the day. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye. Hi. Hey. Stella! <laughs> <laughs>
and I'll use a nice angled brush and I'm gonna take some of this and literally do the inner corner of the eye. It's just gonna give that really nice pop and highlight of color. So I'm gonna use this on the outer edge of her eyes just to give her a little pop. So let's show her black magic. And I would recommend using an angled brush to apply it so you can get more of a precise application versus using it from the actual doe foot itself. All right, so there you have it. A really simple, easy look that you could do for daytime or use it as a nighttime look. There's many different colors that you can choose from to switch out your looks, which is really, really, really nice because at $5, you really can just go ahead and buy all of them. And that's it for now, folks. And that's all, folks. Okay. Hi guys, I'm Anna, I'm the global artist here at ELF Cosmetics, and today we're gonna play around with some glittery eyeshadow looks using our Earth and Ocean eyeshadow palette. Comes with 18 shades. So you see already, I've already prepped her skin with our Flawless Foundation and um, a little bit of our Flawless Concealer. And I've used our Sweet Tooth Sponge Trio. This will help get the whole face done, pretty much. So before we start with the eyeshadow, I'm gonna use the eyeshadow primer in tan, so that way it can create a base for the metallic and the glitters to hold. Hmm? Did I say primer? Come on, baby. I thought you did. Yeah, I did. You weren't paying attention. Just kidding. So to start with this look, I'm gonna actually go into Mojave Mommy, which is a little bit deeper than her skin tone, and use it in her crease. And I'm gonna go like a windshield wiper motion. So next we're gonna take a dense bristle brush, which is our eyeshadow C brush. We're gonna dip into Lagoon, and then we're gonna tap it on her eyelid. Pressing it in so that the glitter adheres to the primer. A little tip is to wet the brush a little bit with some setting spray, and then pick up some product, so that way it can definitely lock it in on the lid for more intense color payoff. So you definitely wanna pack it on in layers. So next we're gonna take this color, Tundra, and line her lower lash line. And I'm gonna use our Precise Smudge Brush. I've already dampened it just slightly so it can pick up that pigment and the shimmer that's in this shadow. And then we're going to go ahead, look up, tap it on underneath her lashes. It's okay if you get it a little bit messy because you could just swipe off the excess with the dry brush. And next we're gonna take our No Budge Retractable Liner in black and line her inner waterline. And then we're gonna finish it off with some mascara. You want to tease the root of the lashes and bring them upward. Using our Primer Infused Blush in Always Rosy, I'm gonna take this and dab a little bit on the apples of her cheeks just to give her some color. All right, so to finish off this look, we're gonna go with our Candy Kisses Lip Balm Trio. You guys tape the heck out of this thing. <laughs> Sorry, guys. And the shade that we're about to use today is called Bear Kiss. So, let's go ahead and dab some on her lip. So there you have it, an edgier glitter eye with a soft, subtle lip and cheek. look with a sleek, glossy eyelid. So before I put the actual product on her eyelid, I just wanna mention that we started and prepped her face with the Flawless Finish Foundation, and then we did our 16-hour camo concealer today. So what you're gonna need for this look is our Jelly Pop Face and Eye Gloss. For this, I will recommend do not put anything else on her lid. You want a bare lid so that way you don't see any creasing of like any color or anything like that. And you're gonna just lay a layer on her actual lid, like so. You can take your finger and then do the edges. Again, the great thing about this is you don't have to be perfect with your application. 
And then we're gonna also do her lashes as well. And now on to the fun part, lips. We're gonna start off by lining her lip with this pencil. What's really great is that it actually has two sides. One is the actual brush, and then the other side is the liner. So we're gonna start off by lining her cupid's bow. And one thing that you should do if you do not have a steady hand is use your pinky and rest it on your own chin so that way it gives you a little bit more control. And it's really great to do a liner first before any bold lip because it's gonna help give you a guide to give you a crisper, cleaner lip line. Now we're gonna go ahead and do her High Shine Liquid Lipstick. What's really great about this High Shine Liquid Lipstick is the doe foot applicator itself. It has a nice curve to help hug your lips. And if you mess up, it's okay. Take your concealer, which I have our flawless concealer right here. So you're gonna take a lip brush or a small precision brush, dip it into your concealer, and then you can underscore your lip line, and it will give you like that really pretty crisp lip look. So there you have it. You have a nice bold lip with a sleek, glossy eye. Cheers. <laughs> rocker chic type of a look. Let's start off with our liquid glitter eyeshadows. We have eight different shades. We have some cool tones and warm tones, something for everybody. A lot of you guys have been talking about our poreless putty primer for the face, and guess what? We made one simply for the eyes. It comes in six different shades, and today I'm gonna be using our white and our black as a base for these glitter eyeshadows. So let's get started. So I'm gonna start off with this Putty Eye Primer. It's the color white, and I'm gonna shape out her eye as a base before I put the liquid glitter eyeshadow on top. So now I'm gonna take our Putty Eye Primer in black and carve out the outer edge of her eye for that winged eye look. I'm gonna extend it past her eye shape, just like so, and I'm gonna color in between the lines. And it's okay to not be perfectly blended because what you're gonna do is take that liquid glitter eyeshadow and put it on top. So today I'm using Bling Bling and I'm gonna put it right on top of where the white is. And I'm gonna blend it into the black a little. Then I'm gonna take Black Magic and lay it on top of that black. So I'm gonna hug her bottom lash line just to connect where the wing out is. Then I'm taking Bling Bling and putting it right on top. And I'll take Black Magic and put it on top of the black. All right, so now I am gonna take our No Budge Retractable Pencil and do her waterline with the black. That's pretty much it. Then we're gonna finish off with some mascara. And again, my trick for mascara is to bend the wand right at the edge and then go from the root to the tip and shimmy shake it so that way it can plump up your lashes. Now let's do the other side. <laughs> that pretty much gives her that really pretty rocker chic look. She can go have a nice night out on the town, go to the concert, go to the festival, wherever, and she's all good to go. Right? Yeah. All right, guys. Bye. Bye. <laughs>